Hi everyone, I wanted to make a quick packing video of my Kipling uh, uh, Dry, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Um, I'm going to try and go through this pretty fast because I have my two kids surrounding me and making noises. So I'll try to do this fast. So this is what you call the mommy pocket. And here is another zipper pocket here. And this backpack diaper bag has two separate compartments so there's you know one zipper here one here and then it has the bottle pockets which have zippers so um if you have like a big uh, bottle or something bottle of water a sippy cup it'll fit because it has elastics here and you could always have it zipped up if you want um, i just have a a hand sanitizer in there and then there's no pockets in the back whatsoever. This is kind of curved, as you can see. It is pretty comfortable to wear. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. It is padded. It's really comfortable. And here is another bottle pocket with the same elastic inside. So let's get started. So in this little D-ring, the hook where the mon mon monkey is, I have a um, Jujube Passy Pod, and here I just have my daughter's pacifier in there. And then in the mommy pocket here, it looks like this. I just have my B major in there, which fits in there perfectly. And then here it has a key fob, which I have my keys attached to. Sorry about that. My older son was drawing on my hand earlier. Um, that's basically what I have there on my key fob. And then it has one pocket here, a pen pocket, and another pocket here, which I don't have anything in them right now. My B major kind of takes up a lot of the space. And then I have my daughter's sunglasses, my sunglasses, and I just have a little um, pill box. It's a Pepto Bismol, um, I guess not box, but a container but i i took them out and i put my own pills in there which is excedrin motrin tylenol um just you know stuff that i might need in here and in this zipper pocket up here i have a booty pod with some johnson's wipes inside i took it out of the container just to put them in here to be more compact and some pacifier wipes and that's all i carry here and this particular bag does have the polka dots inside which i think is really pretty and the color is um, vibrant pink if i didn't mention it earlier and this pocket is pretty deep it goes all the way um down here so if you own a booty pod just to get an idea it's it kind of i mean it doesn't all go all the way down but maybe like two fingers stick out so you kind of get an idea how deep the pocket is. And then on the bottle pockets, like I said, I just have a hand sanitizer. My kids really love this. And it's alcohol free. And um, we have very dry skin. And this doesn't dry your skin at all. Um, I wish I could show you. Well, maybe I could pour some here. It's kind of like a foam, if you guys could kind of see that. I, I would recommend this a lot. I really, really love them. And back to the diaper bag. In this other side uh, bottle pocket here, I don't have anything. If we go out, I just put my daughter's or my son's sippy cup in here. And if um, I'm taking two sippy cups, I'll just take out the hand sanitizer and throw it in here. And then the handlebar here, the hand has a little snap closure. And instead of, if you're carrying it, you know, backpack style, you don't want to have it like this looking kind of messy you can always close it um so i like that feature so in this front pocket i kind of made it my quick um like to grab stuff quickly if i need to this pocket here i made it into a changing station so i rarely d don't use this that much because i'm not out for that long anyways to change my kids outside in case it's, there's an accident but in this front pocket here, which has two double zippers, go by all the way to the bottle pocket down here. Um, and here I just have a medium set piece by Jujube in the Annie print. And this is just my med kit. And then here I just have your basic um, first aid kit. 
and in it here back here as you guys can see i have an ouch pouch also in annie this is a custom piece and in here i just have some honest hand soap and a little hand towel and the reason i have this here is in case we go to the restroom and there's no soap i could always, i always have my soap with me and sometimes my kids don't especially my nine-year-old he doesn't like the sound of the of the dryer so I'll, I'll give him this to dry his hands with and then in this pocket here this front pocket has this front you know big compartment has two mesh pockets that are divided so in this pocket here i don't have anything and this um other pocket here i just have a small set piece by jujube and in here i just have my portable charger with me for my phone or my tablet and then here i have a mark by mark jacobs pouch and in here is basically when i carry this backpack this diaper bag i like to carry something that's flatter usually i'll carry my fuel cell from like nine days i'm really liking how the fuel cell packs from jujube but in this particular bag i like carrying something that lays a little bit flatter so in here i just have my spoon and forks for my kids three juice boxes as you can see this opens you know a good good amount so you can see what you have inside and i have a couple of granola bars and my um toothbrush holder with some straws inside and that's all i carry here i don't like to kind of bulk it up or else it'll bulk this compartment up and that's all i have in this compartment and the back compartment like i said is my changing station basically i just have um my daughter's quick and this quick i use it um for her diapering needs it just has a diaper change of clothes inside a wet bag and my patina pickle bottom changing pad and in here i have a trash bag i do carry with me a hand sanitizer and i just have this back here and that's all i have for her changing quick this is a large set piece by jujube also in the annie print i think it goes really well the the pink on the annie with this vibrant pink of the kipling and in here i just have some clothes for my son um i have some wipes i have a 3t shorts shirt a wet bag and some undies and socks for my son and a toilet seat covering case he needs to go to the restroom when we're out and that's all I have here. And then this back pocket has a big mesh pocket that's not divided. It's just one big mesh pocket, as you guys can see. And in here, I just have a 31 pocket, a toad, I believe it's called. And here, I just have a, some table covers that my kids could draw on. And then I have a um, notepad for my kids to draw on in case, you know, they want to draw. And in here, I have a uh, Kipling pouch it's a clear pouch i think it's called an icom i'm not quite sure if i'm pronouncing it correctly and in here i just have some crayons i like that it lays flat um i was going to use a medium or small set piece from jujube but i didn't it would kind of bulk up when all the crayons were in and in this case it lays flat and if my kids you know want to color they don't have to take everything out they just see what color they want and take it out one at a time and in here in this mesh pocket as well, I just have a swaddle blanket. In case my kids fall asleep on the stroller or it's kind of chilly outside, I'll cover them with this. And that's all I have in this diaper bag. And then in the main compartment, I always put in my diaper bags an Arm & Hammer um, um, little pod that keeps your, your diaper bags or bags or anything smelling fresh. And I always carry one with me in my diaper bags. And that's how I pack my Kipling Audra. And I hope it was helpful to some of the ladies that are looking to get an Audra. So thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.